Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, your best source for the newest Atari games. And today we definitely have a new, new Atari game. Yay. It is the world premiere <clears throat> of Bubble Bobble Yay. for the Atari <laughs> 7800. It's gonna be awesome. The microphone is a bit high. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm gonna reduce the echoes. Yeah. Let me just bring this down a little bit. Just so you can hit, hear the cats meow a little bit. Purring cats. Yeah. Got uh, one in my lap right now. So yes. today, yes, we have the exclusive world premiere Bubble Bobble Yay. for the Atari 7800. Uh, programmed by Old Style. Yay. Who is in the chat. Yay. And music by Bobby Clark, Synth Papalooza. You have to excuse me. I have a cold. Yeah. Annoying. <laughs> <laughs> so my voice is a bit weird. I can tell, even listening to myself. Um, and I'm very excited about this so game. Yeah. Um, but first, before we get to that, we want to thank all the Twitch subscribers who help support the show and keep keep sure. these cats fed with treats. And we have something very special before we get into the game. <laughs> Uh, in in terms of the treat, so after we read the names, if somebody would trigger the treat time, not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. Uh, I want to thank El Nefer, Arms Car Coder, Atari Knight Seventy Four, Atari Age Beef Supreme, Bio Prokop, Charles Donny Mal, Charles Whelan, Chitlala, Cole Patch, Colonel Lama, Cubanismo, Dianoi, Dan, if you see Daryl Ninety Seventy, Doc Mukas, Gamut Dev, Glenn Main, Glory Defender, Ground Trooper, Joe Rapper, Johnny W C, Carl G, Ken Jennings, Invader, Kev Kelly, Croco Twenty Six Hundred, Lambda Express, Lauren T D Z, Mark Anders, Mark Spacing, Metal Atari, McMuse, Mike Soul, Mike Littell, M K Smith, Mother Three, Mister Zarnu, Mister Fix, Muddy Funster, Nostalgic Pack, Ravi G, Cohog, Raymond C R Seventy, Render Ghost, Printless VG, Ricardo Pimp, Six Sweet. Sledgehammer, Smitty B, Spice, Whereas, Ramirez, Teleprompter, D Train, Tiki Dan, KT Foes, Trek MD, VVG, Double Down, X, Ken X. And if you like to support the show, mm -hmm. you can do it for free yeah. with Amazon Prime. Or if you don't have that, uh, it's not free. Um, <laughs> you can support us anyway. Uh, it's treat time. Yum. Oh, Yum. it's no. treat time already. Okay. Oh. Oh, this black cat is ready. Oh, he's pacing. He's pacing. Look at the pacing. <laughs> Here we go. Boom. What is that on the screen? Oh, I don't know. It's a scoreboard. We have a scoreboard. Well, I did technically say wait till I read out the names. And Chelsea Donnie Mao just took it right after the yeah. names. So, you know. Letter of the law. He obeyed it. He knows how rules work. Yes. Yes, he does. <laughs> okay, so are we ready to begin? All right. Let's reset the points All to right. zero. Doop. Boom. And boom. And let's. Oh. All right. Don't try. Oh, oh, it's one for Sprite. One for Sprite, and one is on the board. Oh, one for Atari. There we go. Oh, it's actually on the right side. That's good. Oh, another one for Sprite. Oh, oh my goodness, you gotta throw one. it over. No, you're throwing it right okay, to him. Sorry. He's Atari. too good. He doesn't eat them. He doesn't chew on them. Oh, hit it harder, Atari. 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 Oh, goodness. Okay, I'm gonna give you one each. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, Four no, or two he's for Sprite. Off. No, don't run off. The door needs to be closed, and you I need know. to throw I these. I know. I know. Not yet. Wait till he's back, because he'll run out. Okay. There we go. Okay, that's another one for Sprite. Sprite. Five two. It's Did also Atari makes it hit it? a lot. Oh, good. Oh, Atari. There, we go. there we go. Makes it a lot easier to keep track of the score. Yeah, it does too. actually. <laughs> Don't even need to anymore. It's Three. right there. Oh, oh another ding, ding. first sprite. That only counts as one. Oh, come on, Atari, ring it. Oh my Okay, goodness. one oh. each. Seven four. One and two. Oh my god, it caught in the air. He's getting too good. He is getting too good. Oh, another oh. one for a sprite. I'm throwing that over there. Eight, oh, four. good luck finding that. <laughs> okay, uh, try again, Atari. You can do it. Louder. A little harder. A little harder. Good oh, kitty. there we go. ZPH Treat Tournament is what I named it. Nice. There you go. Oh, it is game point. Oh, nine five. Nine five. There's very little chance Atari will catch up, but. Oh, he's got it stuck in his tooth. Oh, no. Oh, no. Here comes a game point. Oh, it's game over. point. Ten, My goodness. Five. Final cool score. For you. Yeah. Can we get an end of the year compilation? <laughs> yeah. Sped up yeah. Ding, like, ding, 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 ding. Cap zooming. Oh, around. no, no, no. We're done. We're Roll done, guys. Done. You Ten already five. got some extras. 
There you go. Good kitties. Yes. That was fun. Somebody mentioned it the other day, the other show. They're like, oh, you should have a score on the screen or yeah. something. And I'm like, I bet there's an app out there yeah. Ooh. that can do that. Thank you, 48K Ram, for rating. Welcome <laughs> to the show, 48K Ram viewers. We tonight have the exclusive world premiere of Bubble Bobble Yay. Um, by Old Style and Synth Papalooza. Um, he first contacted me about this game. Yeah. October 13th, 2021. Mm. And I haven't been able to talk about it <laughs> since then. <laughs> Over a year and a half. 2021, did you say? Yes. Oh my goodness. Yes. Yeah. He's been holding it. Developers holding work it. on these games for a long oh, yeah. time. Like yeah. by the time and oh, you can open the door. Oh. By the time it gets shown to the public, some of these developers work on it for many, many, many years. <laughs> Old style's like, damn. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, it happens. Um, so he said, hi, hi, James. Hope you and Tanya are doing well. I saw your wish list. I maintain a wish list on the Atari Age forums Do you? under the Zero Page Club. Of your, want... the games you wish were ported? Yes. <laughs> Because a lot of people post their games. Oh, I wish this. I want this game. It's like, don't do that. Don't post that there. Nobody wants to see that. <laughs> so I put it on my own section. People have to voluntarily go there. And it's just mm. my wish list. Mm. I'm not asking anybody to make these games. Yeah. Just like, hey, if one comes along, I'll cross it off. Yeah. Move it to completed. Nice. But um, Bubble Bobble is one of them. And I thought there's no way it could be done in the 2600. So I put probably I put 7800 um, yeah. or or Atari 8 bit or something. Yeah. Um, and he, he saw that on there. I'm not saying he did it because, because he that. saw it, yeah. but he did see it. And he said, um, saw your wish list and found found it just so happened to have an um, to have an all time favorite of mine. Mm. Um, and he attached a screenshot of an empty level one. With wow. Bub blowing a bubble. Oh, nice. And I responded with, oh, my God. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah. Uh, the image <laughs> fills me with so much joy. Yeah. The colors, character design, especially the bubble, looks amazing. Nice. Great work. Keep me updated. Um, and he did. And that was and now brings it to yep. us to today, over Yay. a year and a half later. Um, and now it's very exciting. Um, first, let's start with... Where this game has been ported, um, obviously it's never been ported to the 7800. No. Um, but it has been. It started out as an arcade game. That's what I assumed. In uh, yeah. 1986. 86. Okay. Um, in 87, it got ported to Amstrad CPC, MSX, uh, and ZX Spectrum. Surprisingly, yeah. the other two are very capable machines. Yeah. ZX Spectrum is a little lower. A down. little lower down, yeah. but yeah. Um, and 88, it got ported to the Commodore 64, is which what I oh, played it on. Oh, you played on the Commodore 64. And um, which relates to our poll. Oh, my God. What the hell? <laughs> uh, one Troubles. second. Troubles. Oh, 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 no. There we are. There we are. Got a poll here. Where did you first experience Bubble Bobble? Your arcade? NES, because that was a very popular Something system. NES, yeah. Uh, home computer, like Commodore 64, uh, MSX, mm. ZX Spectrum, or another console other than the NES. Mm. Or five, never heard of it, and you just <laughs> happen to be here. Uh, Carl G has never heard of it. I don't <laughs> believe you. I don't believe you. For me, it was the Commodore 64, and it was actually a, a pretty good conversion on the Commodore 64. Gotcha. Pretty good port. I've heard of it, but never seen it in the wild. Okay, <laughs> that that would count if you've actually never seen it. Mm. Um, uh, then uh, also an 88 uh, Sega Master System, NES, 89 Amiga, Atari ST, Apple II, uh, and DOS, um, 1990 FM Towns, Sharp X6800, 91 Game Boy, 94 Game Gear, 2004, mm -hmm. modern. These are all probably perfect recreations. Windows, uh, 2006, gotcha. uh, Java, um, 2007 a Wii, on the Wii, 2013 3DS, 2014 Wii U, and 2016 PS4. Wow. And usually a lot of the modern ones, they reskin it too, to upgrade yes. the graphics. And usually they're very 
bubbly and cartoony yeah. and well, i because they are bubbly really and cartoony. like that look the really shiny look I oh like the, i see what you mean the very edged pixel graphics look to them yeah. but they're cutesy i mean it's a yeah, cutesy game cute. so i get why they it go does on work that theme with yeah that. and it had uh two spin-offs onto its own that were different one was kind of a sequel, Bubble Bobble 2, which is uh, Rainbow Islands, the story okay. of Bubble Bobble 2. Very different game. Mm. It's, it's like a platformer? It's still a platformer, but you, it's a scrolling, vertical scrolling platformer. I really haven't oh, played it. Oh, I see. Okay. Um, but from what I remember, it's a vertically scrolling platform. So you go up, 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 and you can make little rainbows that you can hop up on hey, to get you oh, up. Oh, oh, thank you for resubscribing, Miss Command. Welcome. <laughs> Uh, and in 1994, I was 87, in 1994, uh, Puzzle Bobble, which is very well known as mm. well, and it's its own thing where you match up I like Puzzle Bobble. the yeah. little bubbles yep. at the top of the, the screen. The colors, yeah, yeah. yeah. Super Simple, fun. Simple, wonderful game, yeah. Um, and before we get into the game, I want to show you what the cats did. <laughs> now is for the cat shaming portion of the show, before we get into the game. Because they are trouble. <laughs> And let me show you this picture. Uh, there, we, there go. we go. Yeah. So. Minutes before the show. If anybody could guess who actually did this. Yeah. The gray cat or the black cat. Um, this was minutes before the show. And I'm like, oh my God, cats. <laughs> so we can't keep our toilet paper roll on on the toilet paper yeah. stand or whatever. Because this happens if we leave it out. <laughs> This was an almost full roll. It and, was a full roll. And you can see in behind there, it is almost not a full roll anymore. Um, well, indeed, uh, the uh, sprite in the background... Yeah, he's the perpetrator. Like, I didn't do it. It's yeah. the one sitting. It's, the, it's a gray cat. It's sprite. Sprite does it. <laughs> he, every time, he doesn't unroll it. He takes it off. Yeah. Um, the holder and, and then chews it to bits. Yeah. Like he doesn't go like this. Scratch, hold it and scratch it with his hind legs. So yeah. he like shred it's it. It's like a kick toy. It's a kick toy. So yeah. I happen to, they happen to be sitting there yeah. when I come out of my office <laughs> and I'm like, oh my God, I have to get a picture of this. <laughs> So super naughty. I like how they're right there at the like Sprite is so <laughs> proud of himself. Yeah. And also he's setting up his brother because yes. we know it's not Atari. No we've no. never ever caught Atari doing anything with I've, the toilet paper roll. I've caught Sprite multiple actually times doing it. Yeah. So yes. he's just like it's him. It's him. It's, it's obviously not, him. No, it's him. I have nothing to do with this. I have nothing to do with it. Look at the guy standing <laughs> on it. Yeah. They try and show you love. Uh, they love to show you their handiwork, yes. Uh, they're so funny. I've seen other prob have problems with their cats, but I've had cats my entire childhood through my 20s. Never had any of our yeah. cats do this. Yeah. My retired collection says. Um, and a lot of people put their toilet paper on backwards for kids and pets when so they, they do this. So they don't do that. This would not help. No, because he takes it. He goes, poof. He and knocks it's it off. Off it goes. Yeah. <laughs> I guess if it was locked in, it might work. Maybe. But we don't I have that. I think he would just chew it on the. On the... He, he would the probably holder. just chew it. Because he just there. kind of likes the feel of it. I think it's squishy. So. Yeah, very bad cat. Yeah. So we keep it in a drawer. <laughs> yeah, we keep it right We actually right have beside. a little printed sign. Um, toilet paper in drawer due to bad cats. <laughs> yes. you, <laughs> so people are it. like, where's the toilet paper? Yeah, so hopefully that sign is uh, enough. We'll have to make a bigger he's one. He's a bad cat. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so today we were going to have a live interview with Old Style, but he was unable to make it live. Okay. So he's going to be able to be in the chat. Yes. To answer any additional questions. And you have some... I, I do have an interview question, so he did answer it in text form. Nice. Excellent. So we'll be doing that. And if you have any additional questions, don't ask them before I ask my questions. <laughs> that always happens. <laughs> ask them a little bit later. Um, after we've started, uh, 3d print a locking cover. Oh yeah. Some of those toilet paper rolls have like metal covers too. Yeah. They slide open and close. That's annoying. That's, that would be cool. Yeah. I'm not saying there aren't, there aren't, um, some possible alternatives or yeah, some, some ways of, of doing it for now. We just put the toilet paper in the drawer. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, so the poll. Oh, oh did it disappear? Oh, it's fine. Oh, good. Um, right now, home computer, 41% of mm. people play Bubble Bubble on that. In second place, NES. I knew that would be a big one. Mm. Uh, that's why I sectioned it out. Uh, then tied for third, arcade and other console. 
and also never heard of it. <laughs> Just use the three shells. True, we could set up three shells. Um, that's from uh, Demolition Man. Uh, I don't think no. I know the reference. It's from a movie. Okay. Has Sylvester Stallone in okay, it. Okay, okay. I believe. Yeah. <laughs> or no. I can't remember. Demolition Man. Yeah. Yeah. I got it. <laughs> I, I've only watched a bit of it, oh, but I, I know see. that reference. Okay. Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay. Let's, uh, I think we're just going to get into it <laughs> and then go through the questions bit by bit mm -hmm. and a little bit of an introduction to what the game is about. Okay. One of the best uses of swearing in a movie. Oh, I'll have to watch that. Oh yeah, Taco Bell was is the only fast food restaurant left, or the only restaurant left, and it's now a high-class dining restaurant. I don't remember it. I know I've seen it, but I just movie. remember so little about it. It's a strange projection of the future. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, so let's um, get into it. This is an exclusive world premiere of Bubble. Okay, here we are. So let's uh, switch everything over. I have to switch the inputs or else you guys would see it. <laughs> there we go. Here we go. Are you ready? Come on. Drum roll and bubble bobble. Bubble bubble. Woo! Oh, let me just uh, check something. Cause this may have. Oh, yeah. There, that looks a lot better. Change my settings so the black is black. There we go. Bubble bobble. <laughs> And uh, this has one or two players. Oh, excellent. So we're going to have uh, Tanya start it oh, off. Always. <laughs> yep. Uh, Bubble Bobble, Taito, Be Beaver, or Bust. And it is, this build is from today. Whoop. So it's up to date. Yeah. And uh, there's Old Style's name nice. and Synth Papa Lucy's Very name. Nice. And looks just awesome, that title screen. Very bubbly. Mm -hmm. Very bobbly. Uh, bubble Bobble, uh, you can uh, go for it. So one button is blow, one button is jump. Oh, oh, somebody got gotcha. <laughs> it's been a while. It looks fantastic. Looks oh, there absolutely it. stunning. Yes, old styles ports are amazing. And just to remind everyone, he also did Mario Brothers, which we premiered on the show, and also Lunar Patrol, which is Moon Patrol, port of Moon Patrol. Um, so, Bubble Bobble is a 1986 platform game developed and published by Taito for arcades. It was distributed in the United States by Romstar. Blah, blah, blah. Players control Bub and Bob, and now Tanya's playing Bob, Bob right now. Bob. So Bob is the green one, Bob is uh, the uh, blue one, who's coming on there saying push 2P, 2P to start. Oh, you got squished. Um, you got bit by it. Um, in each level, oh, sorry. Uh, player control Bub and Bob, two dragons that set out to save their girlfriends from a world known as Cave of Monsters. In the 80s, all the, all the women got captured for some reason over and over. Um, in each level, Bubble Bob must, must defeat each enemy by uh, present by trapping them in bubbles and popping, whose turn into bonus items when they hit the ground. Like there, beer and, and bananas. Beer and bananas. Uh, there are a hundred levels total and each becoming progressively more dis difficult. Uh, Bubble Bob became one of Taito's biggest arcade successes and is credited with inspiring the creation of many similar screen clear platform games that followed. It was acclaimed by critics for its character design, memorable trap, memorable soundtrack. That is an understatement. This gets in your head like earworms. Mm -hmm. Ding 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 ding. Root beer to maintain the E rating. Oh, okay, it's root beer. That makes sense. <laughs> Gotta maintain that E rating. 
Uh, oh, look at all that food. I love the food. Yep. There's so, you, oh, it's so many cute. food items. I think there's 99 food items. We'll get to that. Um, and Multiplayer is often listed among, amongst the greatest games of all time. Bubble Bobble was followed by a long list of sequels and successors for multiple platforms. One of these, Puzzle Bobble, has become successful in its own right and spawned its own line of sequels. Okay, so let's uh, get into some questions. So, first of all, this version has uh, rounds one through seven, um, but it does get progressively harder as, as the rounds go up. And it has two of the enemies, um, Zen, Zen Chan slash Bubble Buster slash Benzo, and Maita slash Stoner slash Boris. And the, that is um, Maita. Jump. Oh, oh too, slow. too slow. So let's get into the questions. Uh, can you give us, these are questions for old style. Uh, can you give us a little background on yourself and your programming history? I do software development, not a big surprise. Uh, with the level of expertise yep. that's going on in these games that he's made. Um, and a bit of DBA for a while now. Mostly custom applications UI on the website these days. Oh. That's why the menu in Mario is so damn good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what attracted you to the 7800 for making games on? I, also had the, I always had the desire to make a game. I've been playing them for so long for crying out loud. I never thought of much of the 7800 prior to games like uh, DK and Vicky, uh, Ricky and Vicky lured me in. However, a significant reason was because 7800 basic since it's legible. Most of the dirty work for plotting is handled by 78B, so it makes developing for it that much simpler. I can take 6502 in small doses, but I'm too jaded to v dive headfirst into it. The 7800 is an underrated system and all it needed was some love to have uh, held its own. And that is very true, um, shown by the games that Old Style has been making and all the other amazing developers that have been making a incredible homebrews in the last few years. Um, and of course, Pac-Man Plus, doing it forever. Mm -hmm. um, Hopefully. Bueller? Oh, uh, Bueller? <laughs> oh, the stream is bad. The stream is bad. And they are back. Oh, oh, people in the chat at least. Yeah, they could see us. Yeah. Uh, the stream is, uh, is it fluctuating. Is it rebounding? Yes. I think it's steady. It's iffy. It's iffy. Mostly good. Okay. Okay. I have one thing to say. No one is ever allowed to say screen of death in the chat again. <laughs> It's a little too profet pro um, yeah. prophetic. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's hot. It's only 25 degrees. It's not that hot in here. But, it's pretty um, normal. Okay, back at it. Sorry, sorry, people. <laughs> yeah, that was the that. Uh, the computer itself. Yeah, just too many people watching. Blew. That was the problem. It, it was just bubble bottle bubble was just so big it just exploded. Yeah, like, it was too much for my too computer much. to handle. <laughs> okay. Thank you for holding on. Yes, thank you so much. What, what happened the there? Hell? That's so funny. Um, yeah, yesterday my sound card died and I had to reboot. Oh. Today, the network card gave me trouble. So, uh, motherboard issue, maybe. Yeah, I was just saying you're gonna have to get a new computer. Maybe. Um, can you get a new motherboard? Isn't the motherboard you the can. computer? It, I mean, it is. It's. It, if you get a too new of a motherboard, you have to get all new things. Oh, I see. A lot of new things. I could deal with my video card being fine. Yeah. Okay, let's get back to the questions. Excellent. Sorry, Pete. Sorry. I think I, I finished the last question. Just in time before the crash. At least the blue screen is very visible over there. And I can... Like, oh, it's obvious like, immediately. Oh, my God. Uh, probably before it even uh, finishes... Uh, Shuts, shutting off the streaming, you, you probably see it before it, just before it happens. Yeah. Yeah. Too many bubbles, it bubbles, yes. Bug. Yeah, bug in my computer. Uh, next question, where did the idea to port Bubble Bobble come from? Was there a programming carryover from the port of 7800 Mario Brothers, also a single screen platformer, or was it for the love of the game? Uh, he says, Old Style says, I desperately sought out the NES version of it back in the day, 
And as with Mario, I was disappointed by the NES once again. I thought, I'll wait a few decades to make my own version, and here we are. <laughs> uh, I kid, I kid. Actually, BB is one of my favorites. Always has, always will be. I've been a fan of platformers and co-op games, so this is right up my alley. Oh, old style. Man of my own heart. <laughs> platformers and multiplayer. Oh, keep, keep it coming. Um, this one is always going to be on a list. Uh, it's not particularly exciting, though the thought of it trying to make it for the 7800 did happen while working on Mario, as I thought, because they're, they're similar-ish type of games. Um, before adding the floor bumps, Mario would clip through the floor while jumping up. Mm. Uh, it was in that context where Bubble Bobble popped into my head because of the way it looked, with Mario passing through the floor. What happened? Hit something? No, sometimes I, I don't see them. <laughs> oh, yeah. They fall through the floor. Yeah. And they hit you on the way down. They do. Um, Look at these sprites. I love the hot dogs and the ice creams. <laughs> They're so perfect. Ah. So uh, perfect. Uh, and a big reason I grew tired of working with the same phase layout. I really wanted to have different levels and Bubble Bobble has many of them. And from a development standpoint, I felt it was a spiritual successor to Mario. Plus, I couldn't resist those delicious sprites. Yes, they are. Oh, look at the ice cream. Love it. Uh, Ivy Tower Collection says, I assume the breaks in the bottom of the numbers is a bug. Uh, which number? Sushi? Oh, the 1,000? Like the, the big... I don't know, maybe it's stylized. It looks like it's like into each other. Because the scores look fine. Um, my next question is, Bubble Bobble is one of those games that everybody wished existed on the 7800, but always seemed just out of reach of the system's capabilities. How did you handle the enormous amount of graphics on screen at the same time? And, and he combined this with my other question. Can you step us through how you converted the graphics for the 100 levels, 54 special items, and 96 food items? for the resolution of the Atari 7800. He says, well, not quite there at 100 yet, because he has seven, seven levels at the moment. Still a long ways to go and compression will be necessary. It was hard to project or describe even how much space would be required with this. Early on, I didn't know what was going on. I didn't know what was going to be a 16, uh, 168 or B. So I just said the hell with it and went to head creating the sprites, assuming I'd have space. With bank sets, being introduced by Mike and Matt, my outlook on this went from 50-50 to 80-20. Bank sets open up a lot of space for graphics, but also space for code as well. Admittedly, the back end isn't perfect and it'll need some work, but overall it's less convoluted, less Pischetti. Uh, there are also a lot of treat sprites that aren't animated, so I stuck with 8 to 12 pixels and having small specific set of treats available at all times, while the rest pulled from memory on the fly. If space becomes an issue, then a divide and conquer approach is needed, splitting the bonus point items, alternating between different sets, for example, things of that sort. This is very much a work in progress, and I feel like it'll go through many iterations until the dust settles. The floating scores, yeah. I assume the scores were supposed to look that way. They look like they're supposed to, like that 1000 going up the screen right now. It's probably like, oh, it's shifted over, but it looks like they're kind of squished like, the numbers are squished together. That's what I take it to be. Um, follow up to the last question. What is the state of the game right now in terms of the 100 levels, 15 segments of music, 10 enemies, etc.? Uh, music, in Bobby's hands. <laughs> uh, Sympopolism. Uh, enemies, most sprites slash animations are finished. Just logic is needed, because he has two enemies in this version right now. And levels, long ways to go. About 15 at the moment. And seven are implemented. Here. Seven are implemented. Yeah. Um, and uh, my next question is, of course, the question everyone wants to know, will there be a binary slash cart release? And when do you estimate that'll be? Mm -hmm. He says, yes, a binary will be available in a matter of days. <gasps> there you go. Yeah. Uh, and he says, although it's still a long ways to go, I'd love to see a cart release. And I sent him over some other questions, but he hasn't been able to send those over yet. I'm not sure if he's working on them or if you might want to answer them in the chat. So, Oltsa, let me know if you're typing those extra questions up or should I just post them in the chat and you can answer them in the chat. 
Hey, Pseudo Graphics, welcome. So it looks like I lost a bunch of viewers. Viewers in the crash. Let's see. Oh no! <laughs> Everyone went elsewhere. They're like none of this. None of this. Ah. Oh, lost all my tabs too. Oh no! Luckily, um, nope. both browsers are really good with bringing back tabs. Lost about half the viewers. Oh no! I guess they're like, stream's over. Oh, we saw it. <laughs> no, it's not over. It's oh, not over. No. Come back. Oh well. Um, I sort of did, but maybe easier to post. Okay. Oh, I haven't. Oh no, no, no. I haven't uh, opened my mail after the crash. That might be it. That could be it. Oh no, no, it didn't. Or it crashed after I did get it. Anyway, you can uh, post in the chat. Uh, first additional question is, what kind of compromises did you have to make in order to bring the game to the 7800? Because obviously um, it has different resolution, usually, than say the arcade version. Um, you'd have to remake all the graphics, otherwise it'd be much easier to job just mm -hmm. to port them over because there's different resolutions, there's different color depths. Um, Oh, yes, yes. Let's switch over the difficulty switch. I'm just going to reset the game. Okay. Or uh, can you die and then start over? Sure. It may need to, um, to die to do that. Um, because on the other difficulty switch, he says, Power-ups for the time being, power-up spawn modes are based on the left difficulty switch. Off is a normal game, which I had it on. Um, so arcade rules. Power up spawn are based on other actions or collecting number of things when on, which I just switched it to. Player actions do not affect, and it's just the demo tour uh, just spawning. Next power up. Um, there, it's working. Oh, okay, so you don't have to die, but you can die. Now as well. in your last life. Um, and the difficulty increases every loop around, one through seven, so eight. When you go back to one, it's uh, more difficult. Mm. Um, well, let's see. The time it takes for the bubbles to pop is increased for the loop as well. If you stay alive for several rounds, the bubble pop speed will gradually increase. If the player is dead, then it resets. You can start again yep. to the baseline of current loop. And he also recently added in the extend. Um, oh, sushi. I know. I like the sushi. That's sushi are nice. awesome. Oh, and uh, let's try and identify all the things. Yeah. Oh, not a big enough jump. I love the animation of, of him getting hurt. Yeah. <laughs> it's great. S spinny, spinny head. No. Oh, he said grab that. The, the, um, the oh. lamp, but you missed it. Oh, is it a, a lot of points? Because some things have effects. Oh, They're I didn't like know that. Ups. Okay. Yeah. Oh, good double jump. Cake. Oh, get the cross. Get the cross. Ah, no, no. Don't die. Don't want to die. Oh. And you I'm missed dead. another bonus item. That one's hard to get. It is. Because there's so many ah. of them. Don't. Oh, get it. Oh, no, it's not. It didn't do anything. Uh, old style's not answering your questions. <laughs> so maybe old style, you can post the questions and then the answers in the arcade. In the... Um, in the chat? I'm not sure how you want to do that. Hot dogs, hot dogs. If I can open up the chat here. Oh, he'll do that. Okay, that'll make it a lot easier. Um, okay, so I'm going to read through some more information. I'll get it. Um, about the items. Oh, actually, let's read about the endings. So Baron is not in this version right now. This is just levels one through seven. And um, maybe, but old style, maybe you can answer that question about how you're going to implement the end boss, which mm -hmm. is a massive, massive sprite on the screen. So Bubble Bubble has three endings. The bad ending, the good ending, and the true ending. Um, they are unlocked depending on how you play the game. The bad ending. 
if the game is beaten in a, in a, by a single player, Betty is rescued from a bubble, but not Patty. The game tells you to never forget your friend. <gasps> oh, funny. And send you back into the game to try again. The good ending, if the, player, if the game is beaten in multiplayer, Betty and Patty are rescued, but the game informs you that you have not reached the true ending. The player needs to replay the game in super mode called Super Bubble Bubble. Activating the super mode is done by inputting a certain joystick and button combination, which is provided in the good ending screen, and must be deciphered by the alphabet in the first secret room, in the starting screen. Oh my god. And then the true ending. If the game is beaten in super mode, Betty and Patty are freed. A large bubble dragon drops down and tra transforms into Bub and Bob's parents. The game then plays a message. Congratulations, you could help your father and mother. They were controlled by somebody. Who is he? No one knows of it. The truth is in the darkness forever. Oh, that's so strange. Baron isn't done yet. Uh, I have the regular enemy sprites, but I do want to include the big versions as bosses like Sega Master System. Very cool. Okay, I'm gonna jump in for okay. the, end of the game. Hey, I just restarted. That's so. two player. And we're back can... at round one, so. Oh, can I only do it when when he comes on the screen? No, I think you can do it anytime, can you? Or is this point still in trouble? Oh. No. Nope. Maybe you do have to do it right at the behind. Maybe. Can you imagine trying to decode those instructions while playing the arcade version? Yikes. Yeah, no kidding. Tanny may have used the last credit. Oh, oh so should I just die? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, you've got four, four lives to go, but shouldn't take too long with Mr. Speedy there. Oh, and the ghost. The ghost of doom. The hurry up ghost. wonder what game was the first one to use a hurry up type of thing so you didn't lounge around. Was it Berserk? Because Berserk has oh, that probably. bouncy head that yeah. it's like you, you can't just Terrifying lounge around. that head. Joust? Joust? Yeah, does Joust too? Joust has the uh, pterodactyl. Mm. Comes on and goes rawr, rawr, mm -hmm. and destroys you. Berserk. Defender. The baiters come out if you take too long. Which came out first? I want to say Defender? Okay. Two player. Here we are. Two player bubble bubble. A dream come true. Oh, ah! he's angry. Don't stay near the top. Dangerous. Try, just try to get this out of your head. <laughs> just try. It's not gonna happen. Root beers. Peach. Banana. Gems. Get the gems. Get them. Get them good. Get the bee. Oh. oh, we both died. We're too close. Bananas, bananas. Oh, burgers. The graphics are so good. They Look at that burger. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Like you could see the patty, the tomato, the lettuce in the hat. So good. Oh, so, oh, some uh, ice cream, some purple ice cream. Would that be? Ba, 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 ba. Oh my God! Jumped right into it. So stupid. Need more extend letters, quick! Come on, jump ah. up! Come on, jump! What are you doing down there? There you go. Come on, come on up! Oh, we're gonna have to go follow it all the way down. Oh, some cake. Mm. Some Maybe strawberry. I'm be hungry for some strawberry oh, shortcake. Oh, strawberry shortcake. Good stuff. I think we have. We don't have any cake. Whipped cream. Oh, some more sushi. Somewhere. 
Whip oh yeah, we do have whipped cream, but we don't have any cake. We don't have any strawberries. Uh, no. Watermelon? Ooh, very nice looking watermelon. See, I'm very suggestible when it comes to food, ah. and, and games like this just make me want candy and ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> we do have lots of candy. Candy and ice cream. Left over from our trip. Yes. We, buy, we always buy lots of... Way too much candy. So the jumping and the bubbles Excellent. feel so natural. Yeah. Like, like I've played Bubble Bobble so much in my life. Everything feels really, really good. Ah! So Nostalgic has a question. Um, do you adjust the enemy or bubble behavior to reduce the amount of objects on the screen on the same line, or are you staying arcade accurate? Very good question. Burgers! Which we had for dinner. Yes, we did. Yum. Very yummy. We got these very strange... Corn, corn ribs! ribs! Which, which are like... Oh, Oops. jumped right into them. Um, which, the corn is like in quarters. Oh, it's delicious. Sla oh, very delicious. But just unusual. It's uh, like cut. It's like corn cut in... Quartered. In quor yeah, quartered. And slathered in barbecue sauce, so it tasted just amazing. Oh my god, I got hit by the boulder. Oh, get that! Get that! Where am I? Get that. Where am I? Get to the... Oh, you're nowhere. It's me. Where am I? Oh. Did I die? Yep. You died. Oh, I lost too many lives. Oh, I thought I could no. continue. Guess not. One, one continue. You only had one quarter going to the arcade. Aww. <laughs> Chelsea Mouse has got a bag of gun bears and trying not to overindulge in. Can yeah. you read the answer? To what? From old to style? Old style? Bubble count has been a challenge. Been desperately trying to add more. Down and kill me. Okay, we have to do better. Do better? Do better. It's coming for you, watch out. So stay off the top level. <laughs> you died already! Donnie Mao is a bag of gummy bears. Yeah. That's what I said. Yep. Hard to not eat continuously candy when there's candy in front of you. Oh. I think I'm the worst with chips. Oh, chips are the best. Because you can eat so many of them. What killed me? I think it, they hit me and then you got to... Uh... Oh my god. Bananas, get all the bananas and root beer. Get that root beer, get that root beer. Somebody put some years. So Berserk was 80, Defender was 81. Okay, so Berserk wins there for the hurry up style. Oh, got a T now. Get some extra. How some many? Britannia. What do you have to uh, Extend. Spell? Extend. Oh, I'm going to die. So you have to get quite a bit of letters, unlike other games where it's like bonus. Yeah. Sometimes you only have to spell bonus with five uh, five letters. So far the game is behaving well. Very well. There's some uh, graphical glitches I saw in the first level, but after that, totally fine. Oh my god, that guy jumped up two levels! How did that you do is that? pretty impressive. Got first, haha. <laughs> I first. Yum, 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 Old style, what is your process of recreating the artwork? Yes, that is one of my questions. It lasted a couple weeks. Self-restraint is hard. Oh, some fries. Those are really nice. And had a bee on it for Bubble Bobble. It's the Bubble Bobble restaurant. Is that why? I don't know. I'm sure it's B for Bubble Bobble. Hey, 
was some yeah. game that I was playing. It was a Bubble Bobble style game, and I was trying to make my way through it bit by bit. I can't remember. I haven't played it in a while. My shoe. But it was very hard. And it had saving, so... I can't even remember what platform I was playing it on. Might have been the Switch? Yeah, the reduction, reductions he had to make, make in um, number of bubbles, you don't even notice. Because really, the only... Oh, that guy's gonna come out. Oh, just missed dying on that one. I, I smacked him multiple times, but sometimes... Oh, what is that? Muffins? Muffins. Um, yeah, yeah, you don't notice because you really only concentrate on the, on the bubbles that are, like, right in front of you. Ice cream. We had ice cream yesterday. What flavor did we have? Uh, oh, chocolate chip cookie dough. Chocolate chip cookie dough. Oh, it was good. It was a um, vegan version. There's a wonderful uh, Where am I? There. gelato restaurant up the street from us, and yes. they have fantastic ice cream. Really good ice cream. Everything's well labeled. They also had an Instagram, <laughs> and they yes. had this little mechanical Instagram clicker, like mechanical. so that if you followed, they would flip around. Sorry, um, and and the number would update, kind of like those those old school alarm clocks that had like yes, flip like um, flip over numbers. It was so cool. So and the guy in front of me in line thought it was hilarious, so he kept following, unfollowing, following, unfollowing, following, and it, unfollowing, and it updated. And it kept updating. I thought it was really neat. Maybe. I've seen people with them before, but I haven't seen it like at a store. It's your last life. Careful. Oh, no, I've never seen it at a store. Oh, no. Got the cross. It was nothing. Yeah, it was really neat. I was just laughing. Oh, he, it was he very was, cool. He was just Messing like... with it. Yeah, having a lot of fun. I was surprised it, it updated so quickly. The poll, very, like The instantly. polling of it was very quick. Yeah, we need one of those in the background here. A little mechanical... Uh, I've, I've seen those... I've seen them too. They're, I've seen electronic ones. They're very expensive. Oh, I bet. Like to buy ones that's pre-made. Oh, yeah. That's what it does. Yeah. And that's the one you see in everybody's videos. They're like a ridiculous price. Yeah. For very, very is. neat though. Oh. Okay. But it's just like it's just pre-made. Oh, I'm dead now. Oh, I died too. That's okay. Uh, let's see in the chat. Ships are the worst for this kind. Yeah, I think uh, it is for a lot of people because they're just. Their perfect balance of savory and salty yeah. and sometimes sweet. Did you see Rendered Ghosts? I wanted to buy a box of Mike and Ike's. They sent a mm. 1.8 pound bag. <gasps> oh my god, I love Mike and Ike's. Yeah, Ike's is also a huge Mike and Ike's one. Yeah. They have such good flavors. And then he said, uh, it lasted a couple of weeks, self restraint was hard. <laughs> yeah. It used to be very into Skittles. Yeah. And then I ate too many and then I got sick. None of the big items dropped yet. Okay. I saw one big flashy thing, but um I'll try and play till um You James, yeah. Oh there we hey! go. There's a Just big one. as old old South said it. Wow, that's how you get a high school. Oh yeah. Yeah. That looks big, says Chelsea doing now, yes. That is a big one. Oh, I want the tea. Oh, I already have one. And trying to get an extra life here. Oh, oh, shall I? Oh, oh! Oh, he jumped up and smacked me. Ooh, there's a lot of angry, angry characters on this screen now. Oh, it's pushing me. You do okay. push around. Ah, 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 so many. It's ah. much easier with two. I'm going to jump up to the top. Oh, no. no, no, no. <laughs> bubble, bubble. Okay, so you play some more. Collecting mm. the same letter three times as spawn a staff. Oh, we did see the staff. Mm. I think I saw a staff, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Okay, so uh, mm. you play some more, and I'll read out some more about it. Okay. Old style needs to answer some more of my questions. Oh, there was a heart. Flashy, um, flashy heart. 
Do you have any bonus features over the top over top of the arcade version that you have planned or that are on your wish list? Um, by me, I mean like that, like um, things that you're gonna put into the game that aren't in the arcade game that you maybe I wish they were in the arcade yeah. game. It's like, oh, I wish Bubble Wobble had this, or maybe some extra levels, or extra characters, or you know things like that. And also, how close to the arcade? Are you planning on making it? Like, are you doing all the uh, different endings? Um, are you going to add in some bonus levels like the NES had? Um, there's some secret levels too if you do things in a certain way. Uh, Old Style says mini bosses so far. Oh, very cool. And some kind of alt mode, eat to survive. Ooh, that's a very cool idea where if you don't eat bananas on a regular basis, you'll have your like health meter goes down. That's kind of a fun uh, addition. It's amazing people manage to figure out how to trigger some things. There's so much going on in this game. There is. There's so much, so many things that drop down. In those um, next question. With Bubble Bobble being your third highest, third, Story, third high profile port in a row for the 7800. Do you have another game in mind to conquer next, or do you have aspirations to possibly create, to create a non port of your own, like an original game that you maybe have had in your mind? Because some uh, some developers are like all ports all the time. Well, ports are awesome. They and give the, you a starting point too, right? They so. do. It's like and everything. a challenge to get it to work. Get right? it to play exactly how you want it. Yeah. And there's tons and tons of games that have been unported, that are still waiting to be ported for each of the systems, that that people really love, especially on the 7800 where hardly anything was released for it. Really. Oh, come oh, on. you jumped up! <laughs> He's gonna get angry. No. He's gonna get angry. He's getting angry. No. Oh! I've got angry, angry. Uh, I don't remember what his name is. Um. Old Style says, I want to make an original. I might try a sports game. Don't know about that. And yes, my last question was uh, what VVG Double Down posted. Are Luna Patrol or Mario Brothers done yet or still works in progress? They're definitely um, still works in progress. Mario Brothers is very, very far along. Um, Luna Patrol as a good start. Uh, that GG game I showed earlier, James. Mario is up top on the stack, so Mario first. Yeah, because I think he's really close to... Being, ooh, good jump. Most most far along for the ah. Mario. Um, okay, let's see. And if anybody else has questions for old style... Um, please post it in the chat so he can uh, see them. We put a uh, question in front of it. Not that he's going to miss it. Okay. Uh... So I guess there's one extra credit. Like, I could jump in at any time. <laughs> Did you do it on purpose? Jump, jump, jump. I'm trying to get him from behind, but... Uh, uh-oh. Taking too long. Mr. Ghost is coming. Ooh, what is that? Ice cream. Some ice cream sundae. Ice cream, ice, cream, ice, cream. ice cream. I think we have some homemade ice cream, but it's oh, no, pretty it's old. Good. Yeah. We'll make some. Yeah. Yeah, we could make some. Uh, it takes 24 hours. That's the problem. Well, that's true. But we'll probably need it. It's quite nice and warm right now. Yeah, chocolate. Yeah, yeah. chocolate ice Easy cream. Easy to make. Um, so let's see. Gameplay. Oh. In each of the game, each player controls one of the two dragons. Did you know you're a dragon? Tiny little dragon. Aw, they're so cute! Cutest dragons ever. Uh, player can move along platforms, fall to lower ones, jump up to higher ones, and over gaps. Each level is limited to a single screen with no left or right scrolling. However, if a screen has gaps in the bottom, like you just did, um, you can fall through these and reappear on the top. Each level has a certain number of enemies that must be defeated in order to advance. That's all very self-explanatory. Um, actually, let's go to the wiki of Bubble Bobble. It has a lot of interesting information. 
like those different endings. Um, Mario's practically finished, Old Style says, has been dormant for a while. Lunar is going to have a revision based on what I've been doing with uh, Bubble Bubble. Oh, cool. Nostalgic says, how are you storing representing uh, level data? That is a very good question. Yeah, is it compressed? Is it uncompressed? Is there tons of room? I mean, it does have a hundred levels. And I believe they're all... Yeah! Ah, I tried to jump. They're all Not unique. Fast enough. Okay. Um, yeah, the boss... The boss is called Super Drunk. What? The main boss of this game. It's called what? Super Drunk. Super Drunk? Also named Grumple Gromit. Or Baron Von Bonner. I'm guessing they renamed him in different games. Old Style says, Lots and lots of level data going into this, broken down into floor heights, floor actions for the enemies, and bubble paths. Oh, yeah. You do have to think about bubble paths. Mm. Whether they go... Whether bubbles go up in a level or down in a level. Um, there's also water paths, too. Which I guess the water follows the bubble path. Oh, you already had it. Anyway. You need um, two E's. Yeah, haven't seen any E's. Must be hard to come by. Yeah. It's like those, um, what happened there? He shouldn't have gotten me, but that's okay. He was pretty far for me to... Yeah, yeah like he already he was already past you, too. He was past seemed. me. Yeah, that's okay. But it is a work in progress. Yeah, no, no. And these videos do uh, help the developers quite a bit, usually. So you can, uh, I can see the Super Drunk, also known as Grumble Gromut, uh, is reoccurring antagonist in the Bubble Bubble series. He is a giant drunk who lives on the 100th floor of the Cave of Monsters. Um, and uh, there are like little drunks as well. Let's continue on. Um, certain levels contain special bubbles. Thunder, water, and fire. The thunder one, when you pop it, goes ah. in a direction. It goes up, down, left, right. Water ones, you can ride the water down. I remember the water ones. Yeah. I guess those haven't been implemented in this, but... Um, or Some of the hit detection gets you whacked from afar. Yeah. Uh, okay. A couple times it's been a, maybe a touch off, not too far off, but... It's time-consuming process to build around. I might create an app to just do it, or assist in it, because it's all numbers. Yeah, that makes sense. A level editor would be helped to you and encourage some players to make want, uh, to want to make their own. Yes, that would be a very cool um, thing to do. Um, is include some... Oh, that, that, what is that guy doing? He's walking on air. Look at him. Naughty's got special power-ups. Walking on sunshine. Oh, he is. You ended that quick. Oh, you're still going. Oh, you did an extra credit because you were out of I did, okay. yeah. Bye. Muffins, get those muffins. Get those muffins. Bug! <laughs> Old style says. Oh, ah, no, why did you jump? I don't know why I jumped. <laughs> oh, no. I don't know why I jumped. It was very silly of me. Uh, thunder bubbles send a lightning bolt flying horizontally across the screen. Oh, only horizontal. Water bubbles send a torrent of water ah. down through the levels, sweeping up enemies. Fire bubbles create a small flame which land on the ground, setting fire in the area around to it, which defeats any, any enemies that make contact. Bub and Bob are paralyzed by fire or lightning that touch <gasps> Just them. need another E. One more E. Ah. Die. Oh, and no. she What I do on this one is I go bubble, jump, bubble, jump, bubble, it usually jump. usually works out well, but oh. so when you screw it up. Angry. They're angry. They're coming for you. There you go. There's also a rare bubble known as the special bubble that is a 1 in 4,096 chance of appearing. Really? I have definitely never seen that. Probably because of the low chance of it appearing. Ooh, he was Why is this so hard to get them? these guys? Yeah. Because you push them to get them or to pop them? Pop them. Oh, because you push them the along. You have, to, you have to... Pop them from below. You can't jump up, can you? Uh, not up, no, no, no. Oh, I did. I did jump up. I did jump up. Just through the roof? Yeah. yeah. What? 
I didn't know you could do that. Do it again. You can climb the wall. What? You could climb the wall? I guess so. Maybe double jump? I don't know. Hmm. Maybe with a bubble? Pop skulls. Uh, if popped, the special bubble gives Bub and Bob fire breath for five rounds. Ooh. What? Oh my god, I've definitely never seen that. Ah. Gotta watch out for those guys. They throw the boulders. Boulders? I thought they were fireballs. Uh, no, they're rolling. Oh. I see roll, roll, roll. I thought they were like fireballs. Um, special items can appear that uh, defeat enemies or allow Bub and Bob to skip levels. If Bob and Bob do not lose any lives up to a certain point, secret doors appear Done. that take them to a secret room. Nice. With numerous gems to collect. Okay, let me jump in again. You want to play on your own? Uh, or do you want to double up again? Shoot and jump spam. Double up. Jump and shoot against oh. the walls. Can you join? Oh, yeah. you can. I guess the last time I tried to join, there wasn't a... Oh, credit. Are you dying immediately? I don't know, I guess... Why am I dying immediately? I don't know. It's just too easy sometimes. Because we're on the top, and bad guys are jump falling down. Yeah, that's usually... It's a bad idea. But of course, the bubbles rise to the top. Jerry's... Should we have the uh, chat vote to... Um, Dictate where we go on vacation next. <laughs> would that what be are, what options are we are we picking? Well, we have. Or are we limiting them to? Oh, oh we would so definitely you. limit them. <laughs> it's like they would send us to some war torn country. <laughs> it's like, uh, we don't want to go. There. No, they wouldn't send. No. You to <laughs> um, well, we've always had some in mind and some that we've wanted to go back to. Mm -hmm. I'd love to go to back to Japan. That's probably my number one. Or to Australia. Mm. Melbourne specifically. You like Melbourne a lot. Oh my god, it's awesome. You'll love it. Mm -hmm. um, but those are, are repeats. And I think we'd rather go um, to somewhere we haven't been. Mm -hmm. Or we haven't been in a long time. And that in that category would be Europe. Yeah. Number, a number of countries in Europe. Because... They're I'm like in. states in the U.S. <laughs> They're yeah. fairly small. Like a short train ride away. A couple hours train ride. And they have an excellent train system, which I'm sure has just improved since the last time I rode it in uh, 2014? 13? And before that, 2003? Um, so that's Europe. Mm -hmm. Another one is the Mediterranean, which is also Europe. Some European countries. But it's a different a different thing we'd want to do. Oh my god, that almost died. Um, another one is South America. Some countries in South America. That would also be very cool. But they uh, fluctuate in terms of Safety. Safety. Yeah. Depending on what's going on at the time. Lots of places I want to go to. I just feel like there are a lot of places right now that security and safety are a little off. <laughs> yeah. A little fluctuating. A little fluctuating. So, so really, I would say... Gra Graceland? Ah! <laughs> Graceland. <laughs> We're going to exclude the U.S. because we go there all the time. There's um, lots of places we haven't been to oh, in the U.S. Oh, tons yeah. of places. Um, oh, I'm like trying to get catch you in a bubble now. Don't, don't hurt oh. me. You can't. I know. I, I'm like confused. Ah! Over Europe and Mediterranean, I think I'd rather go to like the Western Europe yeah. countries at this time. Get, get your tail caught. I already had a tea. Both have very few letters. Yeah, when I was playing by myself, I got quite a few, but... There we go. Get boom! On. Boom! Boom! Ice cream for everyone! Woo! Um, which European countries would you want to go to? Me? I haven't I'd been to say, a ton. I'd say we'd have to limit it to, like, five. 
because too many is it gets um, through the boulder and I touched it. It happens. More than five, you're staying quite a while. So it's like maybe like uh, just under a week for each one. Like four four days for each one, I find is probably pretty decent. Uh, there was a guy there. Was there? I was trying to pop him, but I tried to get rid of him. Oh, there he is. Moscow. No, no, no. It's not a good suggestion. <laughs> At the right time of century. <laughs> right time of century. There you go. Yeah. Um, and maybe a while before we would venture to that area of the world. <laughs> to put it nicely. Um, same with some uh, Asian countries, mm -hmm. which is sad. Um, we may not see them in our lifetime. That's true. Which is very, very unfortunate because there's some cool places around there. Cool countries, cool people, naughty governments. It's usually the way it works. Yep. Oh, the red guy came and killed us oh. both. Are you... No more credits. No more oh, credits. Oh, I, I see. He's giving a... The game is giving us one, two credits to begin with. Okay. And when you start, I can start. But if we both play, there's zero credits left. Gotcha. That's fair. Yeah. Uh, I'm guessing for the final game, he's going to include some extra credits. Check that. ours out, says Pseudo Graphics. Check ours out. <laughs> Czechoslovakia. Czech Republic, Czech Republic. not Republic. Czechoslovakia. Czech Republic. I'm sorry. I have actually been to Czechoslovakia. Well, I went to Czechoslovakia when I was a kid. My grandmother took me there on a trip, so. Red. I quite enjoyed ah, it. Ah, I'm going to die. That was a long time ago now. Yeah. <laughs> Very long time ago. Hey, dudes, come on, pop up or something. Pick them off one by one. Oh, got two of them that time. Oh, oh where'd he go? Oh, God. Oh, I am taking too long. For you. He's coming. Ah, oh, and I died, so that, that clears him out. That's it? That's it. Great. Um, anything else we should try in the game old yeah. style that we missed? There's a pool of player bubbles, then another pool for special bub bubbles, letters, fires, etc. Okay. Um, it's in the 18 to 20 range. The game can be brought to a crawl in certain levels. Mm. I was thinking of the player collect loose change to have enough for a credit. Oh, cute. that's super cute. That would be cute. That's a great idea. I think you covered most of it. Yeah, there you go. Excellent. And of course, we will play this Oh. Um, as it progresses. As we get more levels. As we get more levels. Yeah. Yep. 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 Maybe at like... Uh, it is so cute. Game I over should it. include scores. Oh, of course. Yeah. yeah. It'll include high scores, I'm sure. Being yeah. saved. Yeah. Game over screens, opening intro where they both float down in amongst a star, oh, yeah. star field. Yeah. And it plays the... Dun, dun, oh, how does it go? Dun, 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 dun. Then it goes into the normal tune. Oh, okay. Because as like a short, it. I, I looked at the number of tunes. There's 15 of them. Yeah. And one is the intro tune, which is okay. eight seconds long. That's cool. And then the normal tune is like about a minute and a half. Do you have any? Did you talk? Because I, I was playing. Uh, any details about who, where the music came from? Like who developed the music for the like, original game? Oh, I'm just curious because if they did anything it's so else? distinctive. Um. The composer yeah. is Tadashi Kimajima. Okay. Um, it doesn't link, so I'm going to have to look them up and see if they composed what else they composed, not if they composed. Uh, let's see. He is best known for Bubble Bobble. Yeah, so there, <laughs> there you, you go. go. He also wrote the music to Fairyland Story. Sound effects for Arkanoid, which is very oh, good sound cool. effects. Oh, cool. Yeah. Um, let's see. Uh, that's it. Yeah. And one more, two more games. Sweet Acorn for the MSX2 mm -hmm. and Metal Soldier Isaac 2 for the ARC. Hmm. That, that's it, which is super strange because the music in it's this is... It's so distinctive. Yeah. Oh, my God. My throat. You okay? Yeah, I'm sick. I'm yeah. Yeah. Um, 15 tunes. It's hard to imagine what the other 14 sound like in the nature oh. of that one track that just keeps going over and over and over. It's not, it's unfortunately not 15 pieces of music. It's just 15 parts. It's like parts. the game over tune and it's like 
Yeah. Five seconds long. Yeah. Or whatever. But they're like 15 parts to the <clears throat> entire. Oh, you poor thing. No. <clears throat> you okay? <laughs> <laughs> Not. Oh, oh, perfect. Thank you for rescuing me. Style. Thank you for All rescuing right, me. Time for another tournament. Um, <clears throat> so let's clear out these joysticks. The cats did very well today. They're all melted. Yeah. Can you uh, close the door? <coughs> oh. Yeah, I'm sick. I had a sore throat a couple days ago. It's just kind of blossomed into the yeah. right? Oh my goodness. There we go. Oh, there's the old score. Oh, yeah, because in, it's in a text file. That's how this works. OBS can read, read text files. So let's reset the points. <laughs> oh, kind of... old style said, I was looking for cat drugs, but you're out of stock. <laughs> oh. We actually don't have much left in there either. It's weird they're out oh, of stock. Oh, that was, um. oh, did you flip that over? <laughs> that was for Atari, Atari oh, 1. Oh, good stuff. Oh, too oh. soft. There we go. Sprite as one. Atari as one. Make sure you throw his far. Yeah, I know. Oh, Atari is ahead. Two Still one. maintaining his lead. Sprite is close behind. Two, two. Yep. Three, two. Oh. <laughs> oh. Three, three. Er. Yep. Three, three. Yes, we just added this today, pseudo graphics. Atari's still ahead. Uh oh. This makes it a lot easier to keep track of the score too, and it's and it's cool to see on the screen. Oh, I went for Sprite. It is now four four. Sprite has tied it up, but he's still lagging behind. Get your head in the game, Atari. Come on. <laughs> there you go. He was like staring off into the distance. Oh, oh Sprite is catching head to head. up. Um, I made that. Six. Oh, Atari. Um, scoreboard. It was just such a simple thing, but yeah, you can skin it. You can make it anything. And I put in the LED lights because I thought eh, it would work with the theme. 7 6. 2600 scoreboard. Yeah, that would be cool. If anybody wants to make some. Uh, oh, too soft. <gasps> oh, oh, nice. 8 7. A solid lead from Atari now. Oh, oh, oh eight, Sprite eight. ties it up. Come on, Atari. Keep your, keep your lead. Oh. Nine game eight point. game points. Oh my God, Atari could take it. Oh, oh nine, nine, nine. nine. It's anybody's anybody's game now. Atari, do it. Oh, harder. 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 Come on, harder. Come on, you can do it. Atari. Atari. Atari, quick. Oh, oh, it was like a tie. Atari just did it before. Just. Sprite. Just. Wow. wow, that was a photo finish. Sprite is cat. Up. Uh, uh, Damn it, that was right down, right Damn. down to the wire there. Good kitty. Put a display on the screen and suddenly Atari knows he wants a win. <laughs> yeah, he's like, he can keep track now. Yeah, that was <laughs> definitely a photo finish. Uh, it's interesting how they always keep to their side game after game. Well, yeah, they just settle they that way. Uh, that makes it good for the score. Atari because... doesn't like to, to move too far unless he wants to take it out of the room. Sprite will hit Atari's sometimes, like... It's got too much energy, that kid. But, he does, uh, yeah. Yeah, he, 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 he good hoovers kid. it up. Good kitties. Good, good kitties. Cats. You want to open the door? Yeah. It's so yes. hot. All right. How's your foot? Oh, yeah, foot update. Yeah. Um, it doesn't really hurt anymore, yeah. which is good. A whole bunch of skin peeled off from around it, probably from trauma. I have no idea. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> oh, actually, probably from soaking it so much. Yeah, you did have to soak it And bandages it and everything on yeah. it. So, and like he's a, lost a bunch of the toenail now, but... Uh, a layer of skin. Yeah, I don't know if people want to see it. I, I don't know. Yeah, you can't really see it anyway. <laughs> um, so let's go back uh, to our main screen here. Um, so it's, it's, it's looking pretty good. I haven't lost the toenail yet, but there's a big... Like, Chunk out of it. Yeah, big chunk in the corner. Yeah. Half of it is like purple. Mm -hmm. Like literally half of my toenail is purple. Mm -hmm. The upper half of it is white, like yeah. it's gone. Yeah. But the other side, yeah. 50% of it, looks normal. Yeah. <laughs> so that's something. So hopefully I don't lose the toenail because that's really bad. Yeah, really. Yeah, it's not but good. But I think there's still a chance. Oh, really? Yeah, because it's very wiggly and oh, it seems Oh, don't loose. wiggle it. I wouldn't wiggle it. That's a different kind of channel, yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, we aren't running that kind of channel. Danny, we see. I think Atari had advantage because Sprite's bell was turned over at the start. Ooh. It was very briefly. He did very get. Brief. He get. He got one. Went up on. Uh, but Sprite. he did that, did didn't he? You didn't do that. I don't, I thought I put them both straight down, but you'd have to go look at the foot, the video footage. Oh, I thought Sprite's no, no worth it, it for replay on that one. Yeah. We need to make a pair, pair of custom bubble Ooh, bubble controllers yeah. now. Wink, wink. Wow. Oh, when I put that would be down, super cute. Uh, bubble bubble controllers. Nice. Uh, oh, when you put so it's your fault. It might be my fault, oh, but you know what? Interference from the he just, referee. He got it. He got it. I mean, he gets a bit of a handicap anyway because he's he he's a little slower. So he's a little fun. older, or yeah. let's say Sprite is a little younger. Yeah. yeah. Um, oh, to continue on our conversation, hmm? um, I would want to go back to London. Yeah. Paris. Yeah. Berlin. Yeah, I've never been to Germany. I'd love to go to Germany. Um. I want to oh, go to Italy. Amsterdam, super cool because it's all bicycles. Yeah, I'd and love the to go water. To I, there's nowhere I don't want to go. Really, <laughs> that's kind of the problem. I, I'd Italy, like to go. Eh. I'd like to go to sort of more of the southern parts of Europe because I haven't been further Spain, south. So Madrid. Spain, Italy. Rome. I'd love to go to Greece. Um, yeah. I'd love to go to Turkey too. So, so I that's mean, the Mediterranean yeah. side of things, and I haven't been to. A, I've been to Italy and I've been to Spain, but not. Yeah. For very long, so I'd be fine places. doing that. Yeah. Oh, oh pseudographics. I'm, so, I'm so, sorry. so sorry. It's heartbreaking. Yeah. It's, it's really hard to lose a pet, so. Yeah. I mean, we've gone through it many times in our life. <laughs> yeah. Losing lots of pets. That. And and time is the only thing that heals it. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. It's very, very rough. Well, our condolences. It's yeah. hard to lose a cat or a dog. Yeah. 7800 logo is flickering like it's this. The 2600. Oh, because oh, of oh. the screen. That's the bubble bobble on the screen. The bubble bobble. <laughs> see if I can angle oh, it to get it, get it a bit more. No, oh, too, too much. Far. There you go. How funny is that? There you go. It's just the reflection. Oh, not quite. Yeah, it's just the reflection. That yeah. works well. Perfect. <laughs> we need a special lamp here to shine yeah. right on it. <laughs> yeah. That'd be awesome. Sparkly lamp, yeah. Um, yeah. but I think we're going to go on a relaxing vacation next. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to think about it. We're going to Portland Retro Gaming Expo. Well, of course. That's a, that's probably our next one. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but that's a little ways off. Three yeah. or four months since uh, October. October. So July, August, September, October. Year. Four months. Yeah. Yeah. That's fun. Yeah. 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 Um, I don't know. I don't know where we're going to go next. I'd like to save up some money first. and uh, Yeah, just before... bubble bobble today. Um, yeah. Because I knew it would be, you know, we'd play it for a while. Yep. It's a short show. Short show. But also James' throat and all yeah, that is probably, my voice is you probably can't out. go for three hours today. Anyway, no, it's so. probably for the best. Yeah. That uh, we didn't have a, a talking interview. <laughs> yeah. Because my voice would have given out like yeah. a couple of days ago. Um, I'm tired. Good <laughs> RC70. Yeah. A couple days ago, be... my throat was sore and then yeah. turned into a cold, and now my throat is sore again. Yeah. Um, so, th thank you so much to Old Style for this amazing game mm -hmm. and world premiere Bubble Bobble, one of my favorite games. I have yeah. a lot of favorite games, but this is, this is high right in the top. Yeah. Right Whenever he there. sees it at an arcade or something, boom, yeah. right to it. I have to it. play it for at least a yeah. little bit. I mean, it's a huge game. It's yeah. so long. Yeah. That's an awesome And game. it didn't crash. No, I crashed. Yeah. Uh, my voice crashed and my computer crashed. Yeah. Oh, wow. Well. I'm going to have to look at this computer, do yeah. some stress tests. Yeah. See what's um, going on. Something's happening. It was happening doing that before. You said that. Like, maybe nine months ago or no but then you fixed it it was the it wasn't it the network card i replaced the network card yeah it's not that obviously really but it, it crashed but again it, it got better for a while yeah it's fine yeah i don't it's know it's doing and it's doing random things yeah like the audio card crashed the other day yeah then the network card went bad and now this crash could it the be the thing, motherboard then it's quite possible mm. um that sucks so what I could do is I'm going to reseat everything, clean everything. Um, do we have something that blows air? I mean, I have little handheld things, but our uh, vacuums only go in. Some vacuums, you can plug it in backwards. and, and I don't think our no. vacuum does, no. Dying power supply. Maybe. 
Irregular Ooh. power supplies. Oh, oh, I'm seeing some uh, Beef Supreme. Yeah, it says the same thing. Maybe it is. the. Wow. That would be easier to fix, wouldn't it? Oh, instant fix. Yeah. Like, I can fix that in a day. Yeah, you could probably test it. it if you had had an extra one you could try it out with. Well, I can test it with my um, uh, meter. What is it? Volt meter? <laughs> volt meter. It's not yeah. a volt meter. Something else. But yeah, it'll be volts. And I could check the volts, make sure it has the, the right amount of voltage coming out of yeah. each of the... Yeah. Yeah. Well, specifically to the motherboard, of course. Um, yeah, so it might be the power supply. That would be... That would definitely explain it. Because if mm. irregular power, if it goes dips or something, yeah, yeah it's going to crash. The whole thing is going to... It's going to freak out and do random things. Mm. Ah, good suggestion. Thank you, yeah. Um, that's great. Yeah. More more troubleshooting. So gonna... see. Oh, and I just got a message about the award trophies again. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> We just to, if anybody's listening that won an award, yeah, they're or, coming or yeah. didn't win an award, or yeah, um, this year we are custom making them, yeah. So it's taking a little bit longer to get them to a standard where we're happy with yeah, them, yeah. We don't want to give you ones that aren't great, and I've had to redo yeah. the molds again for them, so I'm just in the process of doing that. I have some of them done. Um, I think when I have the molds ready, and I'm going to make several, I should be able to make them fairly quickly. But it's been a little bit more of a process than yeah. I had expected it to but be. Either of us. Better each time. Well, yeah, and and it's getting to the point now where I've I've done about. By we, James means Tanya. Hey, James means I, Tanya. I did my part a long time ago. <laughs> it's true. It was just the text. Yeah, on there. he he did and the, the text. design. I did yeah. the three D yeah. design of it and um, got it three D printed. It's but. just one of these things where it's like maybe i'm being too much of a perfectionist too but no, i don't want it to no. look bad so um because these molds need to be going for years like these are the molds well it's easy enough i'm now i'm figuring out how to make them well mm. and uh oh, hi more treats you um, got double treats today so i've made about next year nfts yeah everyone out of, gets an nft out of the 31 i think i've made about 12 yeah I've made 12, but then now I've had to redo the molds, so I'm, I'm doing the next... I think the next batch will be good, and then we'll see if I have to redo any of the ones I've already done. Yeah. But um, but it, we're kind of at the point now that hopefully It's soon, very close that we can do them in mass close. production. Next year NFTs. Uh, Mad, Max says, <laughs> Mad Max says, sometimes power supplies only display that issue under load. Oh, that's oh. above my pay grade. That's above my pay grade. Well, you could just how expensive well power supplies aren't cheap but they're not cheap but they're also not expensive yeah what i could do is buy one and replace it and see if it sorts it out yeah but i usually get the store to make my computers not that i can't i'm just no. lazy yeah <laughs> actually not lazy i just don't want to make put my computer together and something happens something doesn't work yeah. then i have to go something's not working it might be the video card and take it all back in yeah say replace the video card comes back i just want them to put it all together if it crashes they deal it's, with it it's it's on it's on them yeah and I it's like 50 dollars for them to do it and it's like oh that's fine mm. um so if i buy a power supply yeah i would want to buy that power supply for the next computer Oh. If this is bad, yeah, I see. And I don't know saying. if I can just hand them a power supply and say, you "Probably can." Here, put this in my new computer, yeah, and use this, and they'll be like, "I don't know if the computer crashes. Yeah. It's not our fault. It's your power supply." It's like, know. "Oh God, <laughs> oh my God." Um, we do have power supply for the computer upstairs, which I think is a normal tower. I could test it with that, but that's a nightmare undoing it from everything in the computer upstairs and then yeah no don't don't mess don't that know. one back up no it's gonna do simple stuff yeah and just buy a new computer i don't know <laughs> <laughs> we'll have to figure out what to do mine is is old but it works for everything i do right now yeah that's the thing it's like why do i need to upgrade yeah it does like this right now is probably the biggest thing it does well yeah it's it's quite doing intensive. real time streaming encoding yeah and streaming at the same time because it's quite intensive even though it's not really it doesn't really tax it um too much but it yeah. is the most intensive yeah had to try a hard drive they gave out recently so to catch a gut punch if you're oh. not backing it up are you not backing it up <laughs> naughty naughty james backs up everything yeah everything every night yeah yeah not iterative which i haven't wrapped my head around yet but um which is not that bad of a thing. Yeah, we back it up every night um, to 
another drive and then mm. i have long-term storage of stuff that's done done like projects like, yeah like the first four three years of zero page is like on a hard drive on two hard drives wow always redundant yeah because they die and so every year i need to back up year four wow and year five i guess we're in year six wow so i need to get those off this but i just have so much storage on here that i don't really need to not immediately but i do need to do that yeah, yeah. You need to upgrade because the hard ma hardware manufacturer and software companies <laughs> yeah. want you to. Yeah, exactly. Well, so far, it's not pushing me. Yeah. I'm surprised. I'll ju we'll just go. How about we just turn this into a VR show? <laughs> and you can all buy your Apple, whatever they call yeah, them every now. Everybody gets their thirty-five hundred dollar oh, Apple VR is goggles. Forty-five hundred. That's forty-seven in in Canada. Oh, there you go. Forty-seven hundred Canadian. Exchange. There you go. Yeah, thirty-five. So <laughs> everybody strap in for the show. We're yeah. gonna play. Uh, 8-bit games <laughs> on, yes. our, on our 4K yes. stereo display. That sounds good to me. <laughs> One of the drives on my LED on my NAS is red. Deal with that now. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Unless you've got two redundant drives. Yeah. Uh, uh, oh, R70 said, I bought a 500 PSU, 500 watt PSU for an underpowered piece that broke planning for the full upgrade to the new computer. By the time I got it, I needed 750 oh, PSU no. to get what I wanted. Oh, well, you got a backup, I guess, for another computer? Yeah. If that Apple VR system would play Apple well, 2 games, games, that'd be something to... <laughs> yeah. You Why put not? A, you put an emulator on it. I mean, it's, it's just a computer. Yeah. Like, it's, it's got... I mean, it's got the newer operating system, or it's got yeah. this... Yeah, I don't know. I didn't look too far into it, but... Yeah, you could play emulation on a 200-foot emulated screen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's... I, the for the price it's awesome but for the price not many people can afford <laughs> that it looks pretty cool though. hey if someone wants uh we'll sponsor it if they give us an emulator to play atari games on it so yeah how, how awesome would that be i think that would make a wonderful sketch by the way you know so enhance someone this beautiful <laughs> vr system like it. gives it gives it to you know me or james and we're yeah. like but but can it play galaga <laughs> that's right <laughs> like Huge like and galaga. then you just see us playing galaga you know <laughs> In so, VR land. Yeah, what we could do <laughs> is have the output of what I'm seeing, and we can emulate the screen on this TV that we see yeah. normally, and <laughs> yeah. then you would see what we see while we play. There we go. With a recreated room. <laughs> That'd be crazy. Oh, well. Moving furniture, installing software are my least favorite, favorite things. Favorite things, yeah. I would say installing software is much more fun than moving furniture. One of our wedding gifts ah, is a brand new TV. Nice. The first thing I hooked up was my 2600. Nice. Yeah, when nice. we move house, the first thing I hook up is my computer and the internet. Yeah. 100%. Yeah. 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 Hey, Synth Papalooza! Hey. You made it! And it's over. <laughs> but you <laughs> but can, thank you for joining. Thank you for joining and awesome music. Looking oh, forward to all so the good. extra tunes, uh, the intro tune, and all the sound effects and stuff like that. Oh! Thank you, Charles Williams, for subscribing. Yay. 26 months. That's awesome. Um, okay. Oh, just off work. Yeah, it was a short show today because we all we did was play Bubble Bobble the yeah. whole time. So. I just scheduled Bubble Bobble for yeah. today. So we're just in time to uh, read out the names. Yeah. Um, but before that... <laughs> Put it in dark mode. Yeah. I'm just going to show what we're going to be playing... Next show on Friday with Darcy. Darcy's back? Uh, yep, Darcy's Excellent. back. Don't have to do the Friday show with me. I like doing the Friday show. Yeah, it's But fun. that's cool. I'm glad I'm glad Darcy's back. He yes. hasn't been around for a little while. Yeah, because of schedules and yeah. stuff like that. Okay, so Friday is going to be um, Atari 8-Bit uh, Day. We're going to be playing Crownland, which is an older game. Mm -hmm. Um, playing Gold Diggers, a brand new game, Binary Parasite, uh, which is an update from a game we played before, um, which is hitting like ones and zeros and create and figuring out um, puzzles mm -hmm. with binary. You nice. did play it. Yeah, I briefly. think I remember yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Very yeah. cool. Very cool game. So now it's uh, time for Darcy to take a turn. And Gold Diggers is very, very interesting. Um, Crownland is a platformer, and I went, oh my god, I'm going to play that in the show. <laughs> uh because it, it's older but uh, if i run across older games because there's for the atari 8-bit there's just decades of games mm. it just there is no clear-cut homebrew delineation for that because it's a computer 
Okay, okay. So you could have bought it in 1979 and made your own game immediately. Mm. Is that a homebrew? Yes, <laughs> I guess. It's not released through a store or a distributor. So, um, yeah, yeah, it's hard to delineate that for them. For consoles, it's a lot easier because it's like, well, it's pretty hard to make a game for a PS5 for when a it console. comes out. Yeah, yeah. And and uh, games weren't made till 94 or 5 for the 2600. So mm. it's a very clear cut like, crossover. Cro yeah. Like delineation of it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Synth Papalooza says, I'll watch the replay of Always... Oh, I got rid of... Yeah. Oh, because this is uh, not in the right spot. There we go. I've always loved this game. NES was my first experience. NES gameplay was spot on, just everything else. Hard for me to keep playing that version for an extended time. Yeah. There's a lot of flickering because the NES can only put so many things uh, yes, I see. on a line. So a yeah. lot of games had to make compromises. 700's a bit better at it than yeah. the NES. So that's why we get an awesome version yeah. for 7800. Um, and then next Tuesday, probably Jaguar... Uh, this new Jalaga, nice. which I'm looking forward to, La Baie de Mort. Did I say that right? That sounded good to me. La Baie de Mort. La Baie de Mort. De Mort. Um, and Classic Kong Complete. Um, uh, but we have to play these games very soon. Invader and Load Runner. Why did I spell it like that? <laughs> I don't know. That is incorrect. <laughs> um, because that... Uh, is going to end soon. Mm -hmm. When is this ending? Let's go to Ein Vader. Um, 611, so we have five days to do that. So we'll have to check our schedule mm -hmm. and figure out what day we're gonna do that. Maybe we can do it tomorrow or we can do it Thursday. Maybe even Friday. I don't have to. I've checked the schedule. So keep okay. your eyes open for an alert. High score contest. That yeah. we're doing uh, after, after dark. dark. There's All some right. pretty good scores in there now, actually. Nice. So that'll be um, that'll be a good challenge, mm -hmm. actually. Uh, next Tuesday is uh, Dan's birthday. Ooh. Oh, that's excellent. Happy uh, upcoming birthday. So yeah. uh, if you're here, we'll wish you a happy wish birthday you, yeah. again if you remind us because we'll definitely forget. We might forget. Yes. We might. <laughs> we'll try to remember, though. So thanks. Oh, extend the high score. No, there's definitely no need uh, to extend that. I We have a number of days coming to, up to, that, to, for possibilities. To get it. Yeah. yeah. Um, thank you, Dan. Thank you, Rendered Ghost. Oh, great show, he says. Thank you very much. Yeah. It was a lot of fun playing Bubble Bobble. Mm -hmm. um, Synth Papalooza, thank you so much for working on this game. It's awesome. Can't wait to hear the rest of the music. Nostalgia 26. Yeah, hopefully I'll feel better. <laughs> it, the, the, it's not too bad, but I can hear it getting... It's it's progressing fast. Yeah. Like, I had sore for, throat for two days. Yeah. Cold for two days. Now you're now getting I'm on more the stuffy. Third day of yeah. cold, and it's kind of getting worse. But yeah. Yeah. Thank nah. you, JT. Thank you, JT. Thank you, J. Oh, thank you, Beef Supreme, thank for tuning you. in. <laughs> Old style, of course. Thank you as well yes. for making this amazing game. Another uh, game checked off the list for games your, that you wish existed. I wish existed yeah. and were probably impossible to make, but nope, not anymore. Oh, the developers <laughs> uh, for these systems, especially old style, just pull out all the stops and make mm -hmm. unbelievable games uh double down uh charles wheeling ground trooper gamma dev gamma dev excuse me mm. uh, mad max anthony nelms nice pseudographics metal lunar s ramirez s ramirez hey s, s ramirez vitoko Dire 51 and Miss Command and everybody yeah. else who is lurking or were here earlier. Uh, Renard Ghost. And uh, so, like I said, we'll be back mm -hmm. on Friday noon with Darcy playing some Atari 8 bit, Yay. having some fun. And uh, thank you for tuning in. And uh, you can get this shirt at uh, T Public. Mm -hmm. It's got uh, hidden nice. messages in it. Yeah. And it's got ZPH. I'll pop up a bit there move we go. over a bit yeah it's cool a bunch of people Yay. bought it um <laughs> can you decode the message it's in atasky thanks a little hint <laughs> um oh thank you old style always a pleasure to play your games um i'm looking forward to the playing mario brothers again and uh uh lunar patrol 
Oh yeah. Like almost Luna Patrol ba- bra- um, burned into my brain now instead of Moon Patrol. Yeah. I keep thinking it's. Thank you, Kevin Corn, for following uh, just in time, so you'll be alerted for the next show. Yep. It's the last Zodiac message. That's yeah. right. <laughs> this will give That's you all dark. the clues yeah. you need. <laughs> Um, So thanks for tuning in, and uh, we will see you on Friday. Have a great week, everyone. All right. Bye-bye. Oh, didn't switch. What the hell? Here you go. (laughs) Bye-bye.